Hey, what is up everybody on the YouTube? This is Chris or Lunar Man, and I am back. I am not dead, I am back. Sorry, I had a family function to go to over the past couple days. But yeah, um, I'll upload this today, so let's get started on World 2, Level 3. This will probably go up sometime this afternoon, or, I don't know, it could be around lunchtime. Want to buy an extra seed slot? Hell yeah. It'll cost you 750 but you'll be able to choose 7 seeds per level instead of 6. That sounds amazing. Yes. You save up 5,000. I'll say an 8 seed, eight seed slot upgrade. That's a lot of money. 8,000. 8k. Um, let's see. I want these, 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 these. Not those. I guess I'll get these and cherry bombs and I really didn't need eight. I'm probably only really gonna use four four slots. <clears throat> but yeah, sorry guys, I had um a family function that I went to. It, it lasted from Sunday to Monday. I drove down there Sunday morning, got back. Monday afternoon night and now today is Tuesday I was pretty tired last night go ahead and put one of those bad boys probably put another one right behind them just because I can and also I would like to talk about the hearthstone um, the Hearthstone series that I started, I did not forget about it. I just have not been doing it because I've been wanting to do this series. I can do them one Plants vs Zombies video, one Hearthstone video, but that's really up to you guys. If you guys don't mind me just doing Plants vs Zombies for now, then I'm going to keep doing this. But if you haven't seen any of my Hearthstone videos for that series, what I was doing was... I was telling you guys what the what I thought the best cards in each class were. And I think I got to I think I did two or three of them. And I have got like five or six more to go. I think I'm gonna start putting these bad boys on there somewhere. Probably put them this row. Those things look pretty funny. So I'm gonna let me bubble beam you. So this one uses the Pokemon move bubble, this one uses bubble beam. I think I'm going to title this video, like, Pokemon in Plants vs. Zombies. And I like how these things, when they hit the screen door, it makes like a clinking sound. Which to me says that the screen door is straight metal. But it probably isn't. Is it going to be able to get him? Yeah, there it goes. I need a walnut. Um... Put a walnut right there. No, not you. Stamp. It's right there. I need some more of these things somewhere. I'll put you right there. All I hear is like bubbles and stuff. <laughs> it's kind of cool. I guess. I don't need more of those. I need to start planting them. Um, I guess I'll put a row too many. I guess I'll put two rows of these. <coughs> Excuse me. But. Yeah, let me know if you are dying to see another Hearthstone video. Because the new season did just start, and I'm trying to rank up again. I haven't had much luck. <laughs> I think I'm on a winning streak right now, though. I think I'm at, like, rank 18 or 19 with a winning streak. But I'll probably get to 14 again pretty easily, then after that it'll probably be kind of hard. Use a cherry bomb. And it looks like we're done with this level. So, I will go ahead and go to the next level. Dude, but I cannot wait for the curse of Naxxramas Hearthstone expansion to come out. I am going to be so excited for that. There's one, there's, what there is, there's going to be 30 new cards. There's going to be a new legendary. I think it's going to be easier to get legendary cards. 
Um, hey, let me pick. Gotta think about what I want. And I think is well. Some of it's gonna be free to play. Some of it you're gonna have to pay for with either in-game gold or real gold. So what this makes me think of is this makes me think of League of Legends, how you can buy the champions with real gold or or like in-game points or real money. So like, I assume. Okay, so what's gonna go down is the Curse of Naxxramas is gonna come out. They're gonna have the little single-player battle mode thing, and there's gonna be like the five different sections that you can battle through and win stuff in. The first one is going to be free, but the ones after that you have to pay for. And the fifth one you can only get by doing the first four. So what I imagine it being is it's going to be... I bet you you're going to have to save up like... It's going to be like 3,000 gold or some super high number like that that's going to take forever to get. Um... And I only say this because I think of League of Legends, and League of Legends is like a champion costs 6,300 points that takes so long to get. Um, so I think it's going to be kind of like that. I don't know the um, the gold that it might or the real money it might cost. Maybe it's going to be five, like five bucks for the different wings. I definitely think it'll be worth it. So if you're good at arena, start gathering some gold because I think it's going to be pretty expensive whenever it comes out. Nonetheless, I'm still super excited. Oh crap, I need to put one right there. I'm sitting here talking to you guys, not realizing what I'm doing. But nonetheless, I'm super excited if I end up paying for it or not. Um, mainly because there's new cards. Um, there's just a whole bunch of new stuff coming out. There's a new board. Why did you get through? Oh, you're a pain in the butt, zombie. Yeah, now the levels start getting a lot harder. And now I need the fume shrooms more. But yeah, that expansion is gonna, whenever it comes out, is gonna be baller, and I cannot wait. Cannot wait one bit. Also, that I'm thinking about getting Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare for the PC. And I'm not exactly sure what that game is like, honestly. I watched one video on it just because I was kind of bored for the time being. And it looked like Call of Duty, but you could be plants or the zombies and you had like the bubble guns or whatever. But that's just what I take from it. Mmm, nom on that grave. Nom 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 on that grave. So, if anybody plays Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare, and it's not that, please tell me. I'm going to put the walnut right there in this line. Because I'm really curious to see like what the game actually is. I don't actually know what it is. Um, let's see. I'm not really getting that much sun in this game. I guess because all my things aren't big yet. It kind of slows you down a lot. I do kind of want to put the cherry bomb down. I'm not really sure though. I think I will. Nah. I'll put you right there. But other than that, PC games that just came out. I mean, Watch Dogs just came out. Wildstar just came out. I'm kind of broke, so I'm not going to be buying any of those. Um, Watch Dogs does look pretty interesting. I might buy it if I get money. But I need, to, I need to save my money for future stuff like Super Smash Bros. and Pokemon. So, I don't think I'm going to be able to buy Watch Dogs. And I kind of want to buy Black Ops 2, so Steam needs to have like a midsummer sale where it's like 99% off and I can buy Black Ops 2 off Steam for like 99 cents. You should totally leave in the comments if you want Steam to do that. Maybe we can get like a petition going. 99 cent off every day in the in June or July. You know how epic that would be? You'd be able to get Skyrim for like a penny. <laughs> Shoot, I'd be able to buy every single Call of Duty game for five dollars. So we should do the math. What exactly would it be to pay to buy a um, a fifty dollar game or sixty dollar? I think it's fifty dollar. Ninety nine percent off. That'd be epic. Be right there. But yeah, actually, the list of the priorities of things I want to buy, I do kind of want to buy Black Ops 2 kind of first. And 
I guess after that it would be the Super Smash Bros. I need more sun, give me more sun. I should probably put a second row of fume streams right there, but I'm kinda broke on this game. And the game's almost over anyway, so I guess it really doesn't matter. Um saving up for the snow pea. I think I'm gonna title this uh, video 99% off every game in Steam. See how many people view it thinking that it's like legit and go to Steam and like they're in Steam and they're like, wait, he's a liar. These games aren't 99% off. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, but I'm gonna troll you guys. Then I'm gonna like rickroll the end of the video. No, I probably won't do that. But this is looking like the last round I'm gonna play for this because as time goes on, the rounds start lasting longer and longer. So let's see what um, fun thing I get, and then I shall upload this video this afternoon or later this morning because it is only 8:30 right now. I woke up kind of early. All right, gotta ready the uh, cherry bomb. I want the sun though. I want the sun. Um, I will use it right here. Boom! Oh yeah, they need a fast forward button in this game. I know they have one in Plants vs. Zombies 2. But not in this game. Oh, I didn't even get a plant. I just got a freaking almanac. I don't like the freaking almanac. Boo you, Almanac! Keeps track of plants and zombies you encounter. I don't want to view this stuff. I'll view plants. Lame. What's going on? Alright, let's hear him talk, and then I'll go to the main menu. Here. <laughs> I guess he's a pothead. Get it? <laughs> Is, uh, pothead? <laughs> Ever played a game whack a zombie? Actually, no, I'll record. This is fun. It's just like on the what squirrels you know the furry little rodents that dig holes in your lawn squirbos what the heck but instead of a shovel it's a mallet and instead of me it's you all right so we're playing whack-a-mole this is gonna be really fun blah 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 hammer time blah i like the little noise it makes Ooh, it's too pro. Oh, there's more. Die. Come on, this gotta be harder than this. <laughs> this is funny. I'm just like sitting here thinking in my head. Man, this would suck if somebody had a really slow tracking speed for their mouse. And I'm like. Oh, Stereo Series Mouse OP! I think I'm gonna save this sun. This is kinda easy. I always like the mini games because they are a little bit easy. Oh, uh, I guess I can't save it. Or maybe they go away after a while. I don't know. I'll use the, um. I'll use this thing, the Grave Digger. Yeah, get out of here, tombstone. Oh, they got cones on their heads now. I guess they died. I guess they were like construction workers and they died and they were like, Oh, this was his favorite cone. Let's put it on his head when he dies. Ah, wacko zombie. They need to have this at like arcade places. I'm almost done. Yeah, I guess I'm almost done. Where's the pale zombies? So I can make a joke about the pale zombies. Oh, they're getting it. Alright, there's the pale zombies. What kind of joke can I make about them? Um. I guess they were. I guess they were those workers. Oh, final wave. Maybe I'll have to make a joke about them later. Raaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
Oh, this. I love this shroom. It's like the shroom of all shrooms. It's like the hypno shroom. It's it's the it's the drug shroom. Makes a zombie fight for you. So we have drugs now. I don't know. Maybe I'll title the video. We have drugs. I don't know. It'll be interesting. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. This was fun to record, and I will see you guys later.